To follow on from our last video, in which we looked at A3 prints at various document resolutions, let's carry this on with smaller prints. A4, which is around 8.5 by 11 inches in US size. Same as last video, the image from a full frame 36 megapixel camera, uncropped and unedited, the only difference between these prints is the document size as resampled from the original file from the camera in Photoshop. Document resolution at the intended size to print, in this case, 210 by 297, that's A4 borderless. Resized from your camera file either by image resize or image crop command. Now allowing for the limitations of our video equipment, which will tend to average out the visual differences between these prints. Now I can clearly see the really noticeable differences in detail, definition, sharpness and contrast. Now we advise you to try this for yourself. Uh, we have printed uh, 180 pixels per inch, 240, 300 pixels per inch, 360, 480, 600, 720 and we've gone all the way up to 1440 pixels per inch printed to A4 which I'll remind you is 8.5 by 11 inches in US equivalent. Now to my eyes the 180 pixel per inch and 240 pixel per inch print they appear to me to be soft and indistinct. The 300 pixel per inch print is an acceptable image, but the 600 pixel per inch print is clearly more defined with more tone, definition, detail and contrast. Theoretically, the absolute optimum document resolution for this 36 megapixel sensor size and A4 print size is 600 pixels per inch as you need a high pixel density to pack into the small A4 format. If, we're a, if, we're a, if, we, uh, if we want to include as many genuine camera pixels as possible. The prints at 600 pixels per inch, 720 pixels per inch and 1440 pixels per inch are identical. As you would expect, using the same number of genuine camera sensor pixels in each print. If we have a 12 megapixel camera, the best, document cam uh, the best document resolution at this size is 360 pixels per inch. For 16 megapixels cameras, it would be 420 pixels per inch. <clears throat> 24 megapixel uh, document resolution at this size would be 480 pixels per inch and full frame 36 megapixel camera images would be best at 600 pixels per inch at this size. High end 50 megapixel camera images need 720 pixels per inch at this print size. Now is it that important to print to the limit of a genuine pixel count for, uh, uh, from our DSLR sensor? Now, not for every image, of course, but those of us who have invested in higher pixel count, full frame DSLRs or digital backs should be aware of the higher level of true photographic clarity and accurate detail available to us when we break through the 300 pixel per inch barrier. Try creating tent, uh, test prints for yourself and let us know your results. Those of us with lower pixel count digital cameras also need to be aware of this issue when we print yet smaller size prints because we have less physical print size to accommodate all those high quality, genuine camera sensor pixels. Now let's break here and pick it up next time with a new video.